the pastoral epistles, which is First and Second Timothy and Titus, they deal with the household guidelines for a local household, for a local church, the family of family. The family and family household texts deal with the ordering of relationship within the community life using a similar style as the individual families uh, for the household text. So rather than addressing wives and husbands and children and slaves, these texts address the parts of the family of families, which we just example of that were the elders. They're part of the family of families. So it addressed elders, deacons, older men, older women, younger women, and younger uh, men, and slaves and widows. And so you have to decide for yourself which category you fall into. Older men, older women, younger uh, women or younger men, or, or, and so on and so forth. forth. But uh, in some research, we found that the older were considered those who were 60 and up. And, and, and so that's the way they saw the older. So that's what we're going to be looking at today. And so if, if the individual family is broken, individual family, what, what uh, Elder Tim talked on Sunday, if that family is broken or dysfunctional, you will, will, you will recognize it within the family of families because the family of families will be broken and dysfunctional. And so in a lot of ways, we're seeing that in our society, whereas the families, the individual families, are more broken than ever before. In fact, uh, marriage in our culture, in our society, people don't highly value it anymore. They don't really see any value in being married.